How much average power in kilowatts and horsepower is required to lift a block of 100 kilograms to a height of 10 meters in 30 seconds? Okay, so uh, first of all, it's important to note that power is equals to work done. That's work done over time. And by definition, power is simply the uh, the rate at which work is done. That is work done over time. Now we know that work is a form of energy. So it's in the vertical because of the height, meaning that uh, instead of work done, let's consider this to be the change in energy. So this can be the change in energy of which it's just energy being transferred. Hence we'll say work done is the energy that is being transferred. Energy transferred. over time. Now, since we're lifting it at the height of that, and it's against the gravity, of course, we're going to use the potential energy. So uh, in this case, power is equal to the potential energy, the energy transferred over time. And the potential energy is given by mgh over t. So. The mass in this case is 100. The acceleration due to gravity will use 9.81. H, the height given is 10. And all this is over the time, which is 30 seconds. Okay. So if we try to compute this, uh, we get a value of 327, if I'm not mistaken. So 327 watts. But remember, uh, the answer is required in kilowatts and in horsepower. So to start with, let's find this value in kilowatts. So in kilowatts, in kilowatts, we can simply say the power, which is uh, three to seven watts. You can just divide this value by a thousand. So what we get is simply zero point three to seven kilowatts. Okay, just like that. So that's our answer in kilowatts. Now let's find it in um, horsepower. So in horsepower, in horsepower, uh, the idea is one horsepower, one HP is equivalent to 746 watts. So the number of watts that we have is three to seven, like that. So let's say this is uh, equivalent to X. So what we're going to do here is I'm going to cross multiply so that the value of X will be given by three to seven watts times a horsepower divided by seven or six watts. So the 746, of course, or rather the watt will cancel. So 327 divided by 746 will give us 0 0.43834 HP. So in this case, our power is simply 0 0.44 horsepower. Okay. So this is the power in horsepower and this is the power in kilowatts. I hope it makes sense. Thank you very much.